Our generation will not die at the hands of guns, whether it be suicide, inner city shootings, mass shootings, or school shootings. Our next generation, the generation of children coming after us, will surely not die at the hands of guns. They can't. We can't let it happen. I'm Digger Bryant, and I'm a sophomore in April Central. And the reason why I I came here in the war is because I'm tired of waking up and hearing more kids die because of our broken political system. Today, I decided to walk out for all the kids in Chicago who face gun violence every day. They shouldn't have to be in fear when they go to school. I decided to walk out because I just feel like we need to show that people shouldn't look at this through like their political standpoint. I just think they need to think about the kids' lives and like how we should feel safe every day mm -hmm. in a in an establishment that is supposed to be safe. I walked out because I lived in England and they did not have any gun violence there and it is possible. And the only reason that we have gun violence here is because people um, are too stubborn to make any difference. Okay, so I lived in Australia and all my family lived there as well. And they have very strict gun laws and they have basically no gun violence. So I don't understand why we can't have gun violence. Okay, it only happens here. And it's not a um, I'm out here today because um, I it's ridiculous how it's become normalized, how these mass shootings um, and massacres have just been happening and they've been able to happen because they keep happening and we are basically, we are speaking against that and we do have a voice. We are the next generation of voters and um, the future of America, so that's why we're out here. This gun violence should have ended after Columbine. It should have ended after Virginia Tech. It should have ended after Sandy Hook. It should have ended after Aurora. It should have ended after Pulse. It should have ended after Las Vegas. It should have ended after NIU. It should have ended after, in 2016, there were 500 gun deaths in Chicago alone. The fact is that change is long overdue, and you being out here right now signifies that we will no longer stand for inaction on our representative's part. The chronic mass gun violence in America, something needs to be done about it. And also, after Parkland, as a teacher educator, uh, something about it really touched me. Um, and I don't want to live in a country where I have to fear for my life at my place of employment or the place where I go every day. So, one last time, write your representative, register to vote, make your voice heard in November. Thank you.